Welcome to Lebango, the jewel of Angola. I'm your enthusiastic tourist guide, and I'm thrilled to take you on a remarkable journey through this beautiful city. Our adventure begins at the iconic Christ the King statue, standing tall and proud atop Mount Sengwe. As we ascend, catch breathtaking views of the city sprawling beneath you like a colorful tapestry. The statue itself was inspired by the Christ the Redeemer in Rio de Janeiro and serves as a symbol of peace and unity. Next stop, we head to the Tundavala Fisher, a natural wonder carved by Mother Nature herself. Marvel at the vast chasm that seems to go on forever, offering an awe-inspiring view of the surrounding landscape. It's said that even the bravest souls may experience their hearts skipping a beat as they peer into the seemingly endless abyss. Now, let's take a short drive to the Nosa Senora do Monte Sanctuary, a place of religious significance. Legend has it that this site was blessed by a miraculous apparition of the Virgin Mary. As you step inside, the serene atmosphere envelopes you, and you may feel an overwhelming sense of tranquility. To satisfy your taste buds, we'll visit the bustling Chivinguiro Market, a vibrant hub of local culture. Sample some traditional Angolan dishes like moamba and Fange, and don't forget to try cassava, a staple food here. The market is alive with the sights and sounds of traders showcasing their wares, making it a truly unforgettable experience. Ready for some history? Our next stop is the Labango Railroad Museum, where you can learn about Angola's fascinating railway heritage. Engage with the vintage locomotives, carriages, and historical artifacts that showcase the nation's railway evolution. As the sun sets, we head to Praca Joao Paulo II, a charming square adorned with picturesque gardens and fountains. Here, you'll find locals and tourists mingling, creating a lively and welcoming ambience. Enjoy a leisurely stroll, relax by the fountain, and take some Instagram-worthy pictures. For some cultural immersion, let's visit the Labango Cathedral, an architectural marvel dating back to the colonial era. Its stunning neo-Gothic design and intricate details will leave you spellbound. And here's a funny historical anecdote. The cathedral's construction took so long that it's rumored the original architect retired and his son had to take over, leading to the phrase, Like father, like son, building cathedrals. Last but not least, we make our way to Serra de Liba Pass, one of the most breathtakingly scenic drives in Angola. The winding roads will take us through lush green mountains and provide unforgettable panoramic views. The journey might be a bit dizzying, but it's worth every twist and turn. Alas, our adventure through Labango must come to an end. I hope you've had a fantastic time exploring the natural wonders, historical landmarks, and vibrant culture this city has to offer. I'm sure you'll carry fond memories of Labango with you as you continue your travels. Until we meet again as the locals say. Ciao e boa vai gem. Goodbye and safe travels.